Hey guys, how's it going? Selfo Lockpicker here, and welcome back to my Lockpicking Homeschool series. In today's video, I'm going to show you how the Leashy tool can sometimes be a really great friend when it comes to single pin picking a lock. When you take a look at the American lock key that goes to this lock right here, the bidding code is going to be 37883. And if you're a careful observer, one thing you may notice is the eight cuts look like they're already set to the shear line. That is because this tool is actually able to have the longest key pins, the eight cuts, already set to the shear line, so you're not going to need to pick those. And then that seven cut, you're just going to need to just barely tap. So essentially this is going to be a lock that's about two and a half pins I'm going to have to actually pick. And I just want to share that with you and to show you how cool the finding that is. Obviously when you are picking a lock in the field, you may not know what the key is, but it is something that is just really cool to show off. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do some light clockwise tension. And what I'm going to do is let's start all the way in the back of this lock. And let's start to lift up on five. So I'm going to get a few clicks on that. And now we're going to have five, four, and three set. I'm going to lift up on one. And the lock has already opened up. So one thing you may have noticed is I did not touch two. So sometimes on locks like American locks and master locks, you can actually have the cut of your key be off by one cut and it will still open up. So even though this was not set completely on the second pen, I was able to get it open without touching it. And I just want to say that this is something that is a really cool thing to be able to do. And I think that is a very interesting part of a leashy tool. This tool unfortunately is going to be installed in the way opposite, so I cannot just decode it in front of you, but I already have the key and I just wanted to share with you this really cool thing the Leashy tool can do. But either way guys, this is all that I have for you today. This has been a really quick video showing you how using a Leashy tool can simplify your picking just by having a few of the pens set for you already. If you guys have any questions or suggestions, as always, please drop those in the comment section below. If you enjoyed this video and you'd like to see more like it, please subscribe. As always, thank you so much for checking out this video and I hope you'll have a great day and I cannot wait to see you in the next video.